You alright? I was just going to show you how to bisect an angle. Okay, so say for example we've um, not got a true 45 degree angle to cut, so you can just set the chop saw to 45 degree. Um, what we might have to do is uh, is half the angle, uh, and you can see what I'm trying to do on the wall. So this could be anything. That could be on a, a section of flooring, and you're going around with a piece of skirting board, or in this situation, it's a piece of dado rail that's going up the staircase, okay? So what we're gonna do is, first of all, we need to find the datum height of the uh, the dado rail, okay? And then what we're gonna do is I'm gonna transfer the thickness of the dado rail all the way through, okay? I'm gonna do that on both sides. So then what we get is two lines that meet either side. And you probably already guessed it from the line there. That finds halfway on the angle. So all we do is we set the angle from the top there to the bottom on the sliding bevel, okay? Then all we've got to do is set the bevel to the same angle as the chop saw, or the chop saw to the same angle as the bevel. My son needs a wee. All right, so uh, that's bisecting an angle. Um, and uh, yeah, is that better?